know the. Uh, you okay? What's yeah. wrong, bro? You know the thought of throwing up and how like you keep replaying it yeah. and it gets worse and almost starts to build where yeah. you're like you're convincing yourself you're gonna throw up. Yeah. I think that's a metaphor in life because right now your face looks a little discolored. I want to throw up and yeah. like for the last 20 minutes after this workout, I'm like, damn, I want to throw up. I want to throw up. And the more I think about throwing up, the closer like I feel like it's going like this. I feel like I want to throw up. I want, and then I'm like, no, no, I don't want to throw up. And it goes like this. I'm like, I want to throw up. And it's like, oh, oh. And I'm like, I don't want to throw up. And it goes back. And then I keep talking about it. And I'm almost gonna do it. But uh, I think it's a metaphor in life. It's like w whatever your mind starts to focus on, you start to do. I swear. Whatever yeah. you, it's like what you want to become, what yeah. you want to get, what you want to succeed at, whatever throw it is. Up, don't throw up. Throw up. Don't throw up. I think it's a really like very easy metaphor because you can feel it. Yeah. So you're like no. It's just, you're like yes, and you're like no. You're like, I swear, I could probably make myself throw up right now if I kept thinking about it. And every time I say throw up, I, I want to throw up. Oh. Other than that, what's going on, guys? Other than that. Uh, but keep that in mind whenever you do something in your life. Focus on it, it's gonna flourish. Uh, but other than that, what's, up? what's good? I almost threw up. It's, you'll see in the video. But I almost threw up, like right now. What's going on, guys? Bradley Martin here. And uh, I'm just gonna call it like it is. I haven't worked out hard in about probably maybe like 27 years. <laughs> okay. okay, not 27 years, obviously I'm 27. Um, but the last few months I've been slacking, I'm just keeping it real with you guys, because of like other stuff I'm trying to focus on, this and that, whatever, opening the gym, like a lot more like brain stuff that like I haven't been doing for the last five, six years, and this year has been a lot of like brain stuff. Brain stuff. And, I, and I'm not saying that like I don't do brain stuff, like I don't think about stuff. Brain you sound like, you sound like a bodybuilder. Brain stuff. Brain, it's, brain it's stuff. My brain. <laughs> 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 Anyways, the point is like, um, the last year, uh, my, my focus has been on like trying to develop new things other than like what I'm doing. So I've noticed like a lot of the things that I have been doing haven't gotten better because I've been trying to focus on doing new things. And like, I think that's a part in, and I'm not trying to make this video just about this right now, but I just want to talk about it really quickly. I think it's a part in like life and like growing and becoming better is like trying to be better at the things, obviously, as you guys know, that you're not good at. Like I've talked about in bodybuilding, like trying to get your right side better, my right tricep, or trying to like build like your imbalances, like left to right side. You guys asked about certain exercises. So like in my life right now, bodybuilding is kind of like a, to give you guys an example, it's like I'm trying to build balance, right? And before I was just really good at bodybuilding, like doing sports stuff, and then I'm trying to like build all these other things that are not those things, and like I start to know Z start to like slack a little bit because I'm focusing here. And I'm just growing and trying to become better and trying to learn balance. It's just trying to make like dope stuff for you guys to be able to like benefit from at the end of the day. That's what all this stuff has been about. Steve's uh, in the eating, the eating video we did. Right now, we just posted. It's just posted right now, yeah. but this is probably the next day. Yeah. Anyways, um, I'm just sharing that info information with you guys just because that's where my mind's at. But this workout, on the other hand, for everyone who likes to like say, where does the workout start? It starts right here, okay? Um, I haven't worked out super hard in a while, so I was like, all right, let me try something. Let me just like spice it up. And this is nice. If you guys haven't like, let's say you've been out of the gym for like a week and you're like, yo, I want to like crash course, get back into it. Um, it might kind of look like CrossFit, but I promise you it's not. Uh, it's just three supersets, okay? Because I was trying to convince myself to hit legs. And when I said legs, I thought about throwing up. Ugh, I try not to throw up. I swear, like I really want to keep talking, but you know, you talk, you're like, bro, Ugh. get to the fucking workout, bro. bro. I'm trying. All right, I'm serious. First exercise. Help me out. Was the lat pull down, but narrow grip. The it lat pull down, neutral grip. narrow grip. Neutral. Neutral grip, right? The the yeah. The you guys can see it. Obviously, it's in here. And I'm doing basically three sets here, three sets here. So here's a neutral grip pull down. Try not to swing your body weight. And then over here was the leg press. So three and three, and I'm going one and one, like nonstop. The rest, only rest is like walking in between the machines. And if you guys have a gym that's crowded, this is gonna be much harder to do, but. You got like a good time, you probably do it. Or if you have a buddy with you, you can just yeah, switch. Yeah. That's that's have, idea. Having the buddy. So if you have a buddy, you're just here, and then whoever finishes first can kind of like wait a second until yeah. the other person finishes and just cross and, and, and do it. Um, leave like a water bottle there or something. So that was the first superset. And with the leg section, I'm just doing as many reps as possible. Like, I'm not focusing so much on like weight. I did like four plates. You guys can do wherever you guys feel comfortable that's still challenging to like. You shouldn't be able to put like the weights on there and do like 35 reps. It shouldn't be like, it shouldn't be super easy. You okay. should get to like 15, 16, 17 and it starts, to, it starts to get difficult, okay? Don't do like 35 reps. So wherever you're at with the weight, put it there. Whew, the throw up thing. You might throw up by the end of this video. Damn, bro. Uh, 
Okay, the next exercise, I'm using the same leg exercise, so I'm always coming back to that, except for my third superset. So the first two supersets, the pull down neutral grip, the leg press, um, but then I did the dumbbell incline, so it's like I'm basically doing upper body push pull with the leg press. And the, the idea behind like this superset, it's not a true superset though. So I want you guys to understand, true superset, God, I'm so like scatterbrained, but I hope it can help you guys. True superset is when you work opposing muscle groups. So a true superset is like bicep, tricep, right? So bicep exercise to tricep, that's a true superset because the blood flow. This is just, I'm just like this exercise, it's, it's easy to say superset because I'm here, then I'm there, right? But it's not a true superset. So this is just, these are just general supersets. This is going from uh, incline uh, press, dumbbell press to another leg press, same thing. Now the only difference is um, with the pull downs, I didn't increase weight a lot. I kind of kept the weight at like uh, where I was gonna do all three sets. The super set for the incline press, you're gonna increase their weight each set and it's three sets total. Boom, 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 go up each set. Don't get less than 10 reps. So the first one's like the 20, the second one did 15, the last one I did 10. Do not get anything less than 10 reps. You should be able, the weight should be able to go up and the reps will go down, but don't go lower than 10, okay? And then go right to the leg press again, but this time you're gonna start out like your normal leg press wherever you feel comfortable, and then when you start to fatigue and fail there, you're gonna do a shorter range of motion, put your feet in, and just finish out reps. So you're here where you're, where you're more comfortable, it's more easy for you. That's proper, right? More easy? Easier? Easy. What is it, bro? Help me out. Easier. I'm getting better at this. I haven't sweat once in this video. Yeah? Did you notice that? Shit. Bro, what are you doing? No, no. No, you ruined it. You did, I did. Yeah, but it's still in the video. Why would you do that? But your lips didn't say it. It's still in the video. It's okay, I'll okay. Take it. I'll I'm gonna tell you right now, no more swearing, bro. Okay. I didn't swear, so you, you just ruined it. All right. Anyways, so normal grip, normal grip, normal foot placement. So closer, you're gonna like, you're more fatigued, but your range of motion is gonna be smaller, so it's easier for you. Um, then, the last superset is a underhang row. With, it, this looks totally like CrossFit. It's not, though, I promise. <laughs> promise, CrossFit took this from me, okay? It's an under, it's a, excuse me, this is an overhand row. This one you got, you got you, bro, this one got you. I know, this is like a super one. Um, yeah, anyways, overhand row, it's just, I, I worked up to 225, but you guys can do like, it doesn't matter if you're doing a, a quarter. The point is just, get a good time under tension. So don't, don't rush it, it shouldn't feel like super easy. You should be able to control the weight where you're not you're not shaking, you're not moving anything. Like it's just very strict. So 135, did 225, you guys go wherever you want. Just try and increase the weight each set. There's three sets total. And you're basically going from overhand row, like strict strict uh, row, to a uh, you guys gotta be able to like clean it, put it over your shoulders, to a squat. And it could be like a close stance, it's fine as long as you keep constant, consistent tension. And take like a minute rest in between all of those exercises when you're done. So the super set, boom, boom, then a minute at most. And then boom, boom, minute, boom, boom, minute, and then next exercise, same thing, minute, minute, don't rest anything longer than that. Um, I had these on the whole time. Was I yelling? No, not at all. Oh, okay, cool. Um, what else? That's pretty much it. And I didn't throw up. Today was a good day, I used my AK. What? Uh, today was a good day, I didn't even have to use my AK. Oh, yeah. Yeah, bro. What's that, what song is that? That's Ice Cube, what song is that? Comment below, tell me what song that is, because I don't actually remember and I want to put it on my playlist. That's not like, that's just a, wait, is that a song or is that from the, yeah. That was a, that was a song, you sure? Yeah, what's the, what's the Ice Cube song? Where he's like, today was a good, he didn't have to use his AK? It was a good day. It was a good day. Yeah. That's the name of the song. See, he knew that, he knew it like this. <laughs> Thank you. He knew it like that. It was a good day. Yeah, exactly. We should title the video, it was a good day. No, because no one will click on that. Yep. We need a click bait him. Uh, Kevin made me throw up. All right, yeah, but up. I didn't throw up, so we won't talk about that. Cause I'm like, ah, I hate you. I just—it's like all I want to do is complain. Like I noticed that people watch my videos just to complain. What's the thumbnail? Like guys, if you came just complaining, just don't come, or come and just watch it and complain. Whatever, I don't care. Either um, way, you're still there. No, we're not doing that anymore, bro. Okay. This is PG-13 channel now. PG. PG. Why? PG Y? No, no, that's not a rating. Why? Youth. Why? Yeah. Youth. Yeah. Youth. So it's under PG. Uh, I don't know. G. General. YouTube, if you're hearing this, unblock my channel. <laughs> unblock my channel, you you awesome people. <laughs> What's the thumbnail? Uh, uh, I don't know what the thumbnail is. We can take the thumbnail. This is gonna be a thumbnail. It's gonna say thumbnail, black ready. No, I don't know, man. We'll figure it out. We'll get a good picture. Um, but we'll title it. Like the best way to hit like. 
the, the best way to hit legs. Yeah. Or like the easiest way to hit legs. Because yeah. it was. Honestly, it made it enjoyable because of the fact that. And your cardio, too. And my cardio. Yeah. like. And you got six pack abs now. I got six pack abs. It's under. See, look, show them. It's in here. It's under these pockets. Oh, by the way, this is out, too. Look at that. Oh, you didn't even notice it. Where's that from? This is. Uh, everyone knows where this is from, bro. Where's it from? I'm not going to plug it, man. They know where it is. If they want to find it, they can find it's it. It's not Nike, is it? link in the description below. No, this is like. This is Swaggy.com? Yeah, bro, if you could feel this, I wish I could feel this. It's like the nicest. Can you feel? Anyways, I love you guys. I'm out. If you want one of these, it's there. These are actually coming soon, too. They're probably like, where are the joggers? These are like the most comfortable joggers I've ever put on in my life. Is that Nike? Uh, oh, Bracky. No, no. That's the big figure again. <laughs> it's Bracky. All my stuff is, bro. Even this. Is it bikey? Even this. Dang. Honestly, I, I it's, it's so funny, like, because obviously this is like the stuff I sell, but like I legit wear this everywhere. Like I was filming a video with Alex last night, Alex yeah. Wasabi, and uh, we were doing this, uh, if it's on the channel today probably, we're doing this thing. We're doing this thing where like you, uh, you like pick someone up. Yeah. Like with your fingers, just yeah. your fingers. Yeah. And uh, he was like, yo, you think you wear enough of your gear? He was joking because I had it all on. <laughs> I didn't even notice it. I was like, oh, it's just like, this shit, it fits nice, it fits nice. I swore, dang it. It slipped out. One. You said S, and I said it once. Yeah, anyways. You're getting better, bro. I'm getting better. I love you guys. I'm out. Make sure you subscribe, hit the bell, do all that good stuff. Um, and I'm going to start vlogging more, for real. Because I did a vlog and I actually enjoyed it. I just, I realized when I vlog, I have to like, Go do stuff. Because yeah. if I showed you my normal life, which is me like sitting at home in bed, like working, or like Dude, my dogs, you guys would be like, un unsubscribe, unfollow. They'd be like this. They'd be like, weird. Anyways. Like, I don't know if I want to follow this guy anymore. Yeah. Why are you telling him that, bro? <laughs> it's okay, bro. It's part of being normal. Uh, doing nothing? Yeah, bro. It's, you know, it's relatable. People. I mean, that's literally what I do. I sit at home, I watch Netflix, I play with my dogs, I eat, I like. What do you eat? Like order food from like places. You don't cook your body. I cook, I'm cooking now. I started cooking again. You don't meal prep? No, I don't meal prep. Um, One, yeah, I do basic stuff. It's like people be like, "What? Wait, this is not, normal." You're not a bodybuilder. You don't spend. I used to. You don't bro. do cardio. Six I used to be about day? that life. Six times fast and cardio every day. What's your fat burner, right? Fat burner. It may work. I'm not gonna lie. It works. It's just. It's almost like mentally like. I can't do that kind of stuff forever. Yeah, it's not sustainable. I did it for years and I'm just like, oh God. Now the thought of it's like, no, I just want to chill and play video games and play with my dogs and like go to the beach and stuff, basic stuff. So I do stuff like that. But anyways, I'm gonna vlog more. Uh, I'm not gonna bore you guys anymore on this video. I love you. I mean, if, honestly, I feel like if they watch it, they just keep watching it, then they actually, they actually watch my stuff. Yeah. Because everyone else at this point is probably like, done. Yeah. You guys, if you like squad, you actually watch it like all the way through, then you already know. So that reminds me to tell you, make sure you guys subscribe to my post notifications on Instagram because I'm gonna give away a lot of this new stuff that uh, I have coming out. I know I've been giving away stuff. Yeah. I've, been giving, I've been giving away mostly like hats and stuff like that. But I'm gonna give away like sweaters and like all like joggers, like this stuff. The stuff that's coming out like now. So go to my Instagram, tip the three dots on the top right. I'm sure some of you guys have heard this before. Subscribe to the post notifications. And if you if you write hashtag squad within within one minute, then basically I'm doing a giveaway. And all that's doing is like when you guys jump on and you comment and you write squad, uh, basically you're a legend. You're becoming a legend because you're gonna win free stuff, yeah. and all you have to do is write hashtag squad within a minute of the post. So, right, location, okay, be like, swipe, write it, hashtag squad, and then boom, and then basically Kevin like or I picks. It's like the lottery. It's like Hunger Games, and then you just I'll scroll like one, two, three scrolls. You guys will tell me on the live feed because I go on live feed. I'm like, okay, you know, he swipes, and then I show you guys. I swipe it on the live feed, and I show you guys who wins. Send it to DM, and then send it free stuff. So, Flag. everything. The new games flavor of the pre workouts Ooh. out. If you guys want to try that, if you haven't tried that, go try it. That's in the link in the description below as well. Um, that's stuff I'm gonna give away as well. So if you guys don't want to like, hey, I don't want to buy this, then if all you really have to do to like get a chance to win it is turn the post notifications right hashtag squad within a minute and then you get a chance to win every time I post on Instagram. Because you're in it to so, win it. On my main account, which is at Bradley Martin. Yeah, because you're in it to win it. And why not? It's like, it takes just, if you see it takes a second, boom, you get a chance. Why not? And then, and then it looks, then I look cool because I'm a road squad. So, hell yeah, I love you guys. Have a good one.